Hey, what's good, everybody? Hope you all are doing well this morning. Um, I've had a uh, rough last week. I uh, ended up getting COVID. So that was not a uh, very pleasant time for me. But uh, as you can see, I, I made it. <laughs> uh, sat, in, sat in bed for like three days, man. It was terrible. But uh, I'm all well now. So I'm obviously I'm back out here doing my thing. Um, but yeah, if y'all uh, can just try to stay away from COVID, that'd be great. It, uh, it's not fun. But anywho, um, I am here this morning at Bush Wildlife. Uh, I'm in my regular location today in my hide. Um, so far I haven't really seen much action. There's been a little bit of a, uh, egret action, but that's about it. Uh, a few ducks flew by, which is exciting, which means they're coming around. Um... But I haven't seen, like I said, I haven't seen too much action yet. So we'll just kind of hold out here for a little bit. I am going to uh, try and hit some other locations today as well. Um, but as of right now, we're just kind of chilling. Just wait and see if anything shows up at this uh, location here uh, that I'm usually at. I really like this lake. It has a lot of flat flat ground that I get close to the water you know and get that get that shot so uh yeah let's just uh sit around and see what happens guys well I've just accepted the fact that this lake does not have a lot of action on it um, it's just dead, it's just full of kill deer. Um, the egret's still over there, but uh, I got enough pictures of him, last me a lifetime. So, as much as I enjoy sitting in this hide, I think I'm gonna go do some walking around and uh try to find some new areas guys because this this is not panning out this morning and i'm already starting to lose good sunlight so uh yeah i'm gonna just head on out and go in the woods and find some birds because this, yeah Bummer. So this is where I got the limpkin last time, and holy moly, <laughs> the water levels really dropped. Wow. <laughs>
experience, but uh, that sunlight, man, is working against me this morning. Uh, I have no way of trying to get to the wildlife with the sun on my back because ground just gets too soft. Uh, huh. So I'll have to come here a little early in the morning and uh, get here first now that I know that all this water's so low. But uh, yeah, it's pretty sweet. I like this. All right, guys, so I got the limpkins over there. There's three of them right here. This is a pretty neat find, guys. Especially here in Missouri to see all three of them at once. Wow. And they're right here on the other side of this island. I spooked them a little bit. I didn't think they would spook that easy, but they did. They're kind of starting to go around the, the bend here, but I still got some photos of them. It's pretty neat. I'm gonna, I'm gonna try and get see if I can get a better angle on these guys. But uh, yeah, we'll see. Unfortunately, it, it's just it's, the ground's way too soft to get over there. Man, they're, they're right there. <laughs> Sucks, man. The sun's, you know, not in my favor either, so. <laughs> what a golden opportunity, man. I can't even get to it. So I'm just going to enjoy it and just hope for the best. One of them finally came out standing on a log for me, modeling, so that's pretty sweet. But the one that I was waiting for to come out went around the went around the trees, so this is the new one I'm getting the picture of. It's very confusing. Trust me.
All right, everybody, I'm gonna call it a day on this one. Uh, it was a really exciting day seeing all three of the Limpkins together. Uh, the morning was not what I had hoped it was gonna be, but that's just the way this works being out here. Uh, we always got other days. And as always, guys, don't forget to hit that like and subscribe. Thanks, guys. Y'all have a blessed day.